My name is Matt Brown. I'm uh, the, um, I guess, the project manager and developer of the Canab Center, uh, working independently for Kane County over the last four years on this project. And as part of this project, and in being part of doing the project, and coming to know the property very well, this is the old high school where I went to school, that uh, realized we had two rooms which were below ground, which uh, in high school was our small engine shop room and our driver's ed room and uh, had the idea of using this as a place for the creative outlet for young people to be able to come and create the things that they're passionate about and have a space where they could develop um, their skills and then be able to ultimately show them off to the community and in the process be able to get acclaim or notoriety or attention similar to how young people who are involved in sports are able to get that in the small towns in Utah. Hi, my name is Elizabeth Davis. I'm the 4-H faculty for USU Extension here in Kane County. Um, and I've had the pleasure to collaborate with Matt Brown and the Kane County Commissioners to create um, a maker space for the youth here in Kane County. We're, that's where we're sitting right now. We're really excited to have a space that kids can use for um, creative programming. What you can see behind me right now is the setup for Lego League. We have several robotics teams that, are, that now have a place that they can meet for programming and creating their robots and practicing for the competition that's coming up next month. I like the idea of calling it the underground because kids like to be kind of under the radar and I uh, was hoping that this might be a space where young people could come with some very loose direction from adults and be able to create the cool things that they're passionate about.